All right, hello guys and welcome back to another video. In this one, I'll be talking a little bit about a D brand skin that I have on my S7 Edge, or actually D brand skins in general, sort of. And if you've followed my channel for a bit, you know that I did a review of this D brand skin. And now I've been using it ever since the review. And I've had a lot of people ask me like questions like, how does it hold up? Does it wear and tear quickly? Does it even, does it, how does it feel? All those questions that can be answered when you've been using it for a little bit. And I've also had questions that ask how does it leave any marks when you peel it off? Is it easy to get off? And all sorts of that thing. So I figure it's time to do a video about that and answer those questions since I think it's a good time and I've been using this for three months. I had quite some experience and I am going to remove this as well because I'm going to change the look of my phone. So it was just the perfect time to do it. And I've been using this D-Brand skin on and off for basically three months and I've been mixing it with having a case over it and just leaving it naked like this. So we'll see how it have been holding up and take a look around it and we'll talk more about it. So let's get out into it. All right, so here we have the skin here and at the first glance you can see that it just looks basically brand new. It doesn't even look like I've been having it for three months. It could just have been put on, at least to my eye it looks like that. If we take a bit of a closer look here around the camera area, you can see that even that area just looks very, very, very good. No actual scuffs or anything on the actual green part of the screen itself either. It just looks like it's a super high quality material, even though I've been beating this thing up a little bit. And on the sides here you can see that a little bit of dust and dirt particle has been stuck underneath the skin as you can see here. But that's about the ne only negative point I can see about the design of this skin. There's not much else to say really. Just that it holds up very good and it basically just looks brand new even after three months of use. So let's now start to peel the thing off and see if it will leave any marks or anything like that. So as you saw there it went off pretty easy but one thing that I noticed was that it was actually very very strong. The adhesive on this skin is super strong so I had to use quite a bit of force to get it off but let's see if it actually left any marks because since all the force I used to take it off but at the first glance here you can't see much marks at all. I couldn't see anything that had impacted on the glass not even any bits of glue that was stuck from the glass and the skin. So not at all anything really. But what I did see that that dirt thing actually went all underneath the glass. So it might not be the actual Debrand skin's fault. It might be the manufacturing process for Samsung that the glass in between the metal frame is not really tight enough to keep the, all the dirt out. All right, guys. So there we go. I hope you get your questions answered. Then I've been using it now for a bit. And well, just to sum it up, it's really strong material. It really takes a lot of force to be able to pull it apart. I'm not even sure I'll be able to. You see, it's a super strong material and it basically didn't leave any marks at all on the phone itself. And overall, the brand is just confirming that they do really high quality skins. And I would definitely recommend them to anyone that really needs a high quality skin that will last. This one even looked almost brand new, even from three months of use. So it's very impressive. And that's gonna be it for this video. So I hope you all liked it. And as always, stay tuned for more. I upload at least one video every week. And like this video if you did like it. And I'm gonna say goodbye here and I hope to see you around.